Hi guys, this is Robbie, and today I am showing you gameplay for Fortnite um, in my mobile phone, and this is possible using Astro and virtual monitor using Astro to create a workplace on it, and the game is being played on the desktop, but it is being uh, streamed remotely using Parsec application. So let's wait for the game to start up. Uh, my other game has already started on this desktop. Uh, this is one of the uh, user accounts that I'm using to connect to the lobby. Uh, let me get out of here and I'll show you. Um, if you see here, you can see two workplaces have started and uh, this uh, monitor 2.1 is a virtual monitor. Uh, if you can see on my computer here, only one monitor is connected and the second monitor, that's virtual monitor, which is being used by me uh, on my phone is virtual monitor and it is being streamed through parsec application now if you look here uh, it's still loading uh, let's wait for the game to load fully and then continue okay uh, the game has started now as you can see I can move around and yeah so this is on my phone and just uh, just to show you, uh, this is the other account that is being used right now, and yeah, you see here, yeah. So this is possible using Aster, and all of this is running on a system with the eight-core, sixteen-thread processor, as you can see here. And uh, memory usage is quite high because we have two instances of game running. GPU utilization is uh, not that high and if you can see here the graphics memory that is being utilized is just under 5 gigabytes and both of the games uh, yeah so like this um, so I, have, I don't have a keyboard attached to my phone so I won't be able to deploy glider it will automatically deploy so um, that's about it what's my previous video regarding uh, fortnite and how to run it on, on two instances of fortnite so thank you for watching stay tuned for more videos